I'm Dr. Seth Tevel. I'm the librarian here at the National Liberal Club. And today, it's a terribly exciting event. Two dozen people have decided to spend their spare time on the hottest day of the year coming in to edit Wikipedia. The National Liberal Club has a really quite varied archive and library. Everything, including original documents and manuscripts going back to the 19th century, rare pamphlet collections, an exhaustive series of books on the British liberal tradition. Um, and quite a few little rare oddities as well, and uh, we're really delighted to be able to put that at Wikipedia's disposal. I'm looking for d information about the first lady associate member of the club, and also the first full lady member. I think it's hard to find, because you have to read through all the minutes of the meetings of the membership committee, and the lady associate membership started sometime in 1968, and I'm just getting to the whole discussion of what kind of fees to afford them and what kind of privileges to be given to ladies. One of the main reasons why we are delighted to be collaborating with Wikimedia UK is to try and actually live up to our original charter, which is to keep alive the liberal tradition in the UK, liberal ideas, liberal philosophy and discussion of these. And so I think by having a fair-minded and thorough, rigorous series of articles on Wikipedia, that actually helps um, in a 21st century context. This was, uh for a gentleman who was a dry cleaner from Finchley by the name of Harry Wilcock, who was responsible for the repeal of ID cards in the 1950s, because ID cards were introduced as a wartime uh, convenience in World War II, and they were kept on after that, and uh, Wilcock was famously stopped by police, asked to produce his ID card, uh, and said, well, I'm a liberal, I don't believe in that sort of thing. So even though he had an ID card, he wasn't carrying it and didn't think he should do. And he went all the way to court. Originally, he lost his case, but it went to the Court of Appeal. He eventually won, and on the basis of that, um, ID cards were repealed. Um, and he actually died in the National Liberal Club uh, in a debate. Uh, the last word he ever said was freedom. I think there's an, an instinct of sympathy, actually, in the National Liberal Club with what Wikipedia is trying to do, uh, not just because everybody uses it on a day-to-day -day basis as a simple reference tool, but also because at its heart it's about a collaborative project, it's about sharing wisdom and pooling that knowledge and actually thinking we can do better than what we have in front of us and what's already there. Um, and that goes actually for the way that Wikipedia is set up. However good it is on any one day, or bad for that matter, it can always be better and it can always be improved. And there is something inherently liberal, I think, about the improvability of that.